All right, it's that time once again for another Isle of Conquest, February the 14th, 2022. Looks like we have 14 people in there from the SAS crew. We got a pretty good split. Looks like we have a team going to the docks, few going to mid. We got someone going to refinery. The rest are going up to the hangar. Don't forget to hit that like, share, subscribe, notification bell. They're already beating us to the top of the hill, though. We definitely got to stop going out of the middle gate and start taking the east gate. No, you're not going to cap the flag. We can't let you do that. Wow, he got destroyed. <laughs> that demon hunter went down fast as hell. Finish off this hunter here. Nope. Warrior, I'm getting hit up pretty good. I had to hit evasion. Uh, it's about gone now. Rooted in place. They're all on top of the flag. We're AOE them down like they are NPCs. There's a healer that's all up in our face too. I don't have Will the Forsaken just yet, so I couldn't Will the Forsaken that fear. That's too bad. Rogues down. Looks like we got a tank to deal with, too. More healers are on top of the flag. What's the point of their healers coming in to rush the flag? <laughs> Especially a paladin. I guess they got blind. They could probably blind some people, but, you know, it doesn't really help that much, really, because all the AoE coming on top of that flag, it gets broken. Uh-oh. Watch out for the warlocks. Make sure they're not porting anybody. Couple hunters to go down. Mage's ice buck there. Let's start pushing into the back line. Paladin's going to go down here. Almost. I got stunned by Lasso. <laughs> Boy, got lassoed. Yeah, Kano hasn't gotten lassoed in a while. Ouch, I got wrecked there, though. That's too bad. We got all three nodes, though, so that's all I like to see. Finish this guy before I go down. Nice. He did go down. Just had to kill the seed. I'm back up here. Bring Glaives to the hangar. Here they come. Let's go. Got to make sure you escort them over here. Tell them where you want them. Right here. Turn around and start hitting that gate. Where's the other two glaives? I know we had three in this match. They should be on the way, right? Come on. They must be on back there trying to take out some players, too. Here they are. Nice. Yep, we got three glaives over here. This is going to be super fast. Wait, did you guys have hangar, too? Yep. Oh, jeez, this could be... We don't even have to kill their glaives, because there's no way their glaives will kill it faster than ours will. Nope, no, but the airship... I guarantee this is the first time people have seen this strategy. <laughs> Plus, it's, this area is so secluded, too, because right here... They can't glider from their base on top of these mountains here to actually kill the glaives either. They have to come all the way around up the hill. Yeah, you can see them coming from, like, forever. Put a, <laughs> put a couple of stealthies down there to sap them up or whatever. Yep, some demon hunters looking for them. The gate's already 42%. Wow, yeah, this is stupid fast, man. We're only six minutes into the match, and the gate's almost already down. You guys can just glider down from there? Yep. Definitely true. We got some actually found our glaives now. They're going to try to get over here. We had an ice wall to block some. Got warrior and a rogue up here. Rogue's got evasion going off. I shadowy dueled him a little bit so he couldn't hit some glaives for a second there. Evasion's going to be gone. Got him shackled. Warriors needs to go down next. They might kill a glaive, but it's too late. We already have their gate down to 3%. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the Glaives just destroy the gate if they go, you know, unopposed, for sure. East Gate is down. And if you got a glider, you can just run off the hill and jump right here. Yep, you've seen this many times before. I've shown this. You can get into the Alliance base, while even while the gate's up. Just make a right right here, right through that opening, and you can get right into the base. Doesn't have to right now since the gate's down. Got a couple in the courtyard to take out. Pally bubbles immediately. It bops the priest. <laughs> Let's get on a different target. Let's hop over on the mage. Mage icebox. Okay, that's all your defenses for everybody. Now both of these should go down. The priest is not even standing inside of their dome. That's kind of a bad move there. Now let's see. They're taking the priest out. We're going to put pressure on the paladin. Priest is down. Pally will go down next. Yeah, it's pretty much time for all in now, right? Give me that kill there on Bananakin. I've seen that healer before. Sham is down. Grab a bomb and let's go all in on the boss, man. Got to deal with Druid Boy up in here. Popping Tranquility. <laughs> That's always nice when they hit Tranquility just to try to heal the boss and themselves. Soon as we get this room full, it should be pretty quick from that. Lions still have docks. Our gate is at 90%. We already have their boss down lower than our gate. <laughs> yeah, this one's going to be in the history books. Pretty much, you know, glaives are hard to beat, especially if you can got them with the hanger. <laughs> this is a fast match here. Not sure exactly what our fastest match in ILC actually was, but 
It's going to be around 10 minutes here, so it's pretty close. Probably the only way to make it any faster is, like I said before in other videos, bring the demos to the gate too. Have the demos hitting it, get the siege on it, have the glaze wailing away, as well as the gunship. You probably can get it down pretty low, but you got to have all the stars line up for that. I mean, basically no one has to kill any of our vehicles, you know. What are the odds of that alone, you know? Especially the ones that have to go by the base. You know, the cannons up there and all the ranges up top will be trying to take them out, so. Bosses in execute range. They came back to recap their base graveyard, but it's too little, too late. High commander is already under 10%. They barely come in just to see their commander go down. Crushing leap. Doesn't matter. Lights out. Khabib, top killing blows, 14 and 0. May all of your random battlegrounds be epic. A thousand battles, a thousand victories. Until next time, GG for the Horde.